Greetings y'all, Carolina Ramirez here. Here is the what to know brought to you by Verizon Wireless for the week of December 11. Here it is, at the request of the host school, an adjustment will be made to the Woodstock and Tesla basketball games. JV and Varsity girls will be played on December 14th at Tesla. The JV and Varsity boys will be played at Woodstock. Start time for both sites is 4.30. Tickets will be pre-sold Monday 9 o'clock to 3.30, Tuesday 7 o'clock to 3.30 and Wednesday 7 o'clock to 12 o'clock. A link will be available at the office of each site to purchase your ticket order online. Boys games are online only. No tickets will be sold at the gate. Spectators can only purchase one ticket unless purchasing for the immediate family of the athletes. To celebrate the coming holidays, the yearbook committee will sponsor a holiday spirit week beginning yesterday to 12 sixteenths. Yesterday is Christmas sweater, today is Tesla and Santa theme. Wear your school colors and Santa theme. Wednesday is purple up for veterans. Wear your purple to show your support for our military in all capacities. Thursday is Christmas character and Friday is get comfy for Christmas. Students can wear their Christmas onesie or full-length Christmas pajamas. Senior pictures are ready. Jostens will email the order information for you to view and order your picture packets. Information is also posted on the school website. Cade had direct orders to do the senior pictures on Friday instead of tomorrow since his laptop is under repairs that day. Athletic pictures for winter sports will be taken today, which is currently occurring right now. Coaches have distributed ordering forms for picture packets. Las Vegas Preparatory Schools Middle School Section and Tesla High School Orchestra Groups will have a joint concert on Tuesday, 12.13 at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. Please come out to support our arts. Admission is by donation. The G3 interims go home on December 16th. Winter break begins December 19th for students and December 23rd for staff. Students return to school on Tuesday, January 3rd and we have a holiday on Monday, January 16th. Cade will be gone the first two days after we get back from winter break. Parents, when we return after the winter break, we have exactly nine regular days remaining for the second semester. Teacher made exams, or final semester projects will start 109 to 113 and the state EOC and CTE post assessments start 117 to 120. Exams and DEOCs count for 20% of the overall grade. Any student that has an A average and has not exceeded more than 10 unexcused absences will be exempt from their teacher made exam or final project. There is no exemption for state EOX and CTE post assessments. Finally updates, January 17th to January 20th, are half days. Students will be released when all assessments are complete, usually between 1 o'clock to 1.30. Makeups for state assessments will begin around 2.30 on each assessment day. At this time parents, I would like to remind you and students that in accordance with policy 7787, any student that has more than 10 unexcused absences will be in danger of not receiving credit for their class. Students need to make sure all notes are turned into the office upon their return following the absence. Border Collie Unfinished Business Tutoring will resume after the holiday break. Times and dates by subjects are posted on the website. Makeup time for absences is available through Border Collie Unfinished Business Tutoring. See your guidance counselor or teachers for more information on tutoring or makeup time. Well, that ends the tale, straight from the book. I'm Carolina Ramirez, saying thanks for watching and listening.